Thank you, O God, for your protection, O God, for bringing us even to this time of the month. Thank you for gradually, O God, leading us through the month of July too. Thank you for ushering us into the last week of the month of July. May your name alone be exalted, O God. You have been with us throughout our lives. We pray that you be you continue to be with us for the rest of our lives, so that Father will remain in you alone, so that our lives, O God, will draw souls into your kingdom. We destroy the plans of the enemy concerning our lives this week, for we know you are in absolute control, and that Lord, you heal those who are sick, those who are behind the bounds of God, you bring them into the sheepfold. Father, Lord Jesus, we pray for the troubled, the brokenhearted, and we pray that, Lord Jesus, you grant the hard desires of your people. We know that you are in control, O oh God. You speak and no one can challenge you. You have the final say. Thank you so much. We rely on you and you alone. Precious Holy Spirit, have your way in our meeting today too. Help us to understand you in Jesus' mighty name. Hallelujah. Brethren in the Lord, I welcome you this week too to the program, How Do You Understand the Word of God? I trust the Lord that you are doing very well in Him. A more want ye be hukakra. We'll take our devotional reading from Matthew chapter twenty one to thirteen. And because it is long, we'll be jumping. We pray that the Holy Spirit Himself will lead us through. For the kingdom of heaven is like the land like the land over land owner, sorry, who went who went out early one morning to hire workers for his vineyard. He agreed to pay the normal daily wage and sent them out to work. Brethren in the Lord, there was a fixed rate for those who worked throughout the day. And this is what the master did. He went on an agreement with these people. So let's say if it is 50 euros or 50 cities a day, that was their agreement. But then the master went out again and then in the morning he went at, uh, out at nine o'clock and then he went again at noon and then three o'clock and finally at five o'clock on the phone here can you not say already being open crawford in a juma mano now on your more conscious share the records are sabre no said yeah yeah you might always say what they be any akechia de my no um on your more conscious share in this 50 euro no can't so be money that or be more more that cry so i know kind of say a 50 dollars say a 50 pounds and now 50 cities are and no no share and crop for so they buy my own now so now i am not pan on crown and what you know or sell a peer bill a real do me you know it could never be no more yeah juma eh no me and son and you know no or money now back on no more change in a home when you say yeah you always meet them standing idle uh, without doing any work. He engages them and then he gives them work to do. And it came to the end of the day. That was in the evening. And the master told the foreman to call the workers and then pay them. The foreman began from the last workers, those who came at 5 o'clock, and then three and then twelve or the four or shall say so to your mccafe in your bar a tree say no no and crop for no and son of a no me and son of a do me no hallelujah now bro all chair burning in our shots here no i get here or the ma uh momo a chat to a nail i get here or the or new momo d kind of share so the bama omo in your margin call your almost say Said the one man a shrewd face to say no. 
a drum or some of the enemy I can see it I'm saying is that they imagined that those who came early imagined that theirs will be higher than those who came at five but they started paying those who came late at five o'clock and they gave him them the same amount that um the first people were supposed to receive so they 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 thought that once they started with them those at the back with that amount of 50 euro dollars or cities they thought maybe theirs would be higher than those people and so when it, it got to their turn and they were given the same amount they were annoyed hallelujah they protested and those people worked only one hour they said yes you've paid them just as much as you paid us who worked all day in the scorching heat other four he answered one of them friend i haven't been unfair you think i have i haven't been unfair didn't you agree to work all day for the usual wage take your money and go i wanted to pay this last worker the same as you oh brethren in the lord it is not easy other four uh and yeah the other form said what did christ to a d a year juma amera day a bc sabri naka kama christo beba now more veggie or more and channel wabano or see you know your teacher a back and then I say, I see, 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 I it is only the Lord who knows what He wants to give us or the crowns He wants to give us. Even here on this earth, the blessings and favor that He has prepared for us are different. They differ from each other. Hallelujah. Some believers think they should get special favors from Christ for their faithfulness. But God does not show partiality when we are faithful in our work. He provides, he provides for our needs as he wishes. His special favor does not depend on how hard we work, but on his divine plan and grace. Na as a sewa would you di can in a winya um a drumobia or mamma be tri and se so munya nan so nyan copon on yen y ji mo or show biara no nwan kasa et ya ni maka se yo nwa pe or man ni mutieno e dos no bia de a wobe bia fa and non tin ye yan si e bedi no cra me ra de and then nya mi e o yen fi yen chen yen yen dino cra mano all that the lord desires from us is to be faithful unto him he has his reward in his hands brethren in the lord let us trust god with all our hearts let us not look unto people let us not, let us not compare ourselves to other christians for the lord knows how to handle each and every one of us Enty <laughs> Yan so ye brebetrum, ye mani and ananum ebeba. All that I'm saying is that many have come and gone. John Wesley, 
and all the great great men abraham in the bible elijah uh, the paul the apostle and peter and all the rest they are they've come and gone we are also here in this world a time is coming when we also leave this world for our children and our grandchildren to come and take over and so we pray that the lord will help us to remain faithful unto him to the end this is what is important but not comparing ourselves to other people the lord wants people who remain faithful unto him may the lord bless us all and help us to play our part so that we will never be found wanted if jesus come does not come today we'll meet tomorrow on the line if he comes all the better yes one man may be sure to know our line is or bounce me here more but my instance in the engine of crystal it was a set of paper let's remain and stand firm for christ until he comes god richly bless you and have a fruitful day bye bye